fellow Lightroom enthusiasts. I'm going to do a quick tutorial on how to customize your toolbar. Now in the library and the develop module, um, when you're looking in the loop view or the grid view, there are going to be options at the bottom right below it. So you see these options that we see here? Now when you're in the develop module, you're always in the loop view. That means one image. You're seeing one image. You're never going to see a grid view in the develop module because you only can only work on one picture at a time. So here we see our toolbar there and in the library, we come over here to the library, we see a toolbar in the grid view, which we're seeing right now is grid view, or in the loop view. Okay, so if we can click on it, there, we're going to see the toolbar. This is something that you can customize. You can have a lot down there or just a little, or you can have it not show at all. So the first thing I'm going to show you is how to, you know, get rid of it if it distracts you. Just hit T on your keyboard. T. T is in tool, toolbar. So if you wanted to come back, just hit T. Same with the develop module, you just hit T. And now, how you customize it is by clicking on this little triangle in the far right side of this gray strip. So when we click on it, we go down here and we can see all of these different options. And the ones that have a check mark beside it are the ones that I've chosen to see currently. But I can change that. I can say, okay, I also want to add the slideshow which will start a slideshow right where you're at. It's very handy if you're viewing images with a family member or a client. Just the other day I was showing my mother-in-law um, pictures from her anniversary party and I did the slideshow thing. So that's you know, a good, good handy one to have. Um, just going through and adding some that I had taken away just to show. Um, the zoom feature, really important. I love the zoom feature and a lot of times it's not included um, when you first install Lightroom, it's not in there. But you can zoom in and zoom out. So uh, it gives you a lot of options, more than just what the navigator gives you. That's what I really like having the zoom there. And then this is rotate. So you want to you know, change the rotation. But you have to select what's going to be right here. And you do that by clicking that triangle. And then just click on what you would like to see or not see. And so that's it's just that easy. So if you want to get rid of, say, draw face region, well, I can get rid of that and see it went away. If I want to add um, grid overlay, which I don't generally like to see, you know, so I don't have it on there, but um, you can add that and you'll see this grid and then you can hold command for options there and you can customize that. But it's just not something I tend to, to use. To get rid of it, you just go back and check where it's already checked and it unchecks it. Same for the develop module. And I really um, feel strongly about using my toolbar and having these options here for myself. And, and so I wanted to share these options with you so that you can um, add features to your toolbar, which will help you work more quickly and efficiently in your Lightroom.